Hey everyone, welcome to Gentle PSD. I hope you're all having a beautiful day. Today in this exciting tutorial we will be learning about how to create walk by text reveal effect in Premiere Pro. This effect is used in lot of movies and series, so get ready to learn this effect for yourself and use it in your video. Before we begin please make sure to hit the subscribe button and bell icon for more amazing tutorials like this. Without any further ado let's begin. Create new project. I will name it as walk by reveal. Click OK. We will import our stock videos onto our project panel. Now take this first video and place it on our sequence panel to create a new sequence. Here we have this street video. We will create our walk by reveal in this video. We will use this person to reveal our text as she walks past our screen. First take the text tool here, and type in on the screen. I will type in gentle. We will increase our text size. Highlight the text. Go to effects control and increase the text size. We will place the anchor point in the center by holding control on your keyboard and place it in the center. We will place our text in the center. Now take the playhead where this person starts crossing our text. That looks perfect. Now we will duplicate our video layer. Select the video layer and hold out on your keyboard. Drag it one track above to create a duplicate of this layer. As you see our text is gone, that is because our video layer is above our text layer track. Now comes the important part. Select the duplicated video layer. Go to effects control. Click on this pen tool icon to create a mask. Now start clicking around this person edges like I'm doing. We will make a mask enough to cover our text. Join it. Now we created our mask. You can't see any changes just by looking at it. If I hide our first video track, there. We now created a space on our duplicated layer just enough to cover our text spot. If I hide the top layer you can see our text is behind it. Now unhide all the layers. We will animate our reveal effect. Go to effects control. In the mask option under the text, click on this forward frame icon to track that mask. As you see our playhead moves one frame in the time. And this person moved to the left. All you have to do is to grab this mask and place it in that exact position of this person's edges. You can see our text is slightly revealed in the bottom. Now again click on the forward frame. This time it's moved on its own as it's supposed to. Again click on the frame forward. Now move our mask again to this person's edges. Keep doing this process until your text is completely revealed. If the mask is cropping this person's edges, just use this mask joints to adjust it as you want. It will automatically create a new keyframe for that. 
adjust it here and there. There, our text is now completely visible. Let's play it and see the magic. That looks amazing. We now created that walk past text reveal effect. The mask that we created throughout these frames are accurate and it looks good. Now we will make our text disappears when another person walks past it. Move the playhead to see if anyone walks past it. Extend the text layer. Here we have this person walks past our text. We will now animate our text remove effect by using the same method we just learned. Take the playhead where this person starts crossing our text. There, that looks perfect. Select the top video layer. Go to effects control and click on the pen tool. As you see we have a new mask created, make an outline around this person's leg and enough to cover our text size. Just click on the outside of the screen it won't affect anything. Join it. We now created our mask around this person, again click on this frame forward icon. As you see our mask tracked this person. Again click on the frame forward. Now grab the mask and place it on the edges perfectly. Use the pen tool to create a new points to adjust the mask. Keep doing this step until you can't see the text anymore. We now completely masked out our text, let's play it and see the final result. That looks super good. As you see we now created that walk past text remove effect and it looks great. You can always adjust the masks whenever you want. It won't affect the overall keyframes. That looks good. Our text are now completely gone. Let's play it one more time. We will create this effect on our second video. Take this video and place it on the sequence panel. Here we have this person in cycle, crossing past our screen. This time we will create that text remove effect. Take the text tool and type in whatever you want. I will type in hello. Decrease its size.
place it in the center. Extend the text layer to the end. Place the anchor point in the center. Hold out and drag this layer above to duplicate it. In the effects control, I will change the opacity to 50%, so we can see our text. Take the pen tool, take the playhead where this person about to cross our text. Create a mask around this person enough to cover our text. We will now do the same like we did before. Click on the frame forward and move the mask to the edges. Change the opacity back to 100%. We will keep doing this until our text completely gone. We can decrease the edge feather to get that little sharp text reveal. Go to effects control, in the mask change the feather to 5. Now that looks better, let's play it and see the result. That looks great. We now again created that walk past remove effect on our second video. We now learned how to create this reveal effect in Premiere Pro. I hope you liked this tutorial. I will say this once again, your support is what gives me the strength to make more amazing tutorials like this. Please keep supporting me and I will work even harder. We are finally at the end of our tutorial. I hope you enjoyed this video. You can always download all my project files on Patreon. Link is in the description. I will keep posting more amazing tutorials like this. Please look forward to it. If you have any doubt feel free to comment in the comment section. I will reply to it as soon as I can. Hit the subscribe button for more amazing tutorials like this. Hit the like button if you like this video. Until our next tutorial stay happy. Thank you.